So for dessert, we're going to make a Granny Smith apple based dessert. And the reason why I chose Granny Smith apples is A, it's my favorite apple. And since we're in the Big Apple, I thought we'd do a dessert in honor of the Big Apple. So we're going to top up Granny Smith apples that have a lot of flavor and they are crispy and, uh, and, and have a nice texture. We're going to chop them up into small dices and we're going to serve them with whipped cottage cheese. Uh, it's already whipped, it's 1% uh, fat, so it's very low in fat. And um, to that, we're going to add apple butter. And apple butter is a natural uh, a, a product uh, that's made with just apples and apple cider. So there's no um, sugar added, there's no fat, everything is basically apple-based ingredients. And the apple, uh, will um, flavor the cottage cheese and to this we'll just add a pinch of cinnamon and we all know cinnamon and apple go really well together. Quarter of a teaspoon, just a sprinkle, that's enough to give it flavor and you just mix it thoroughly so that all the apples are coated. So this is a totally fat-free, sugar-free dessert um, and not to mention a very healthy dessert. Apples are great for you. They can help to reduce the chances of getting cancer, the prostate cancer, lung cancer, as well as um, colon cancer. And it's great for weight management because it's full of fiber. So the saying, an apple a day keeps the doctor away is actually very true. And we will garnish this with walnuts. And of course, we all know walnuts and apples go well together as in the Waldorf Astoria salad. So I'm sure my guests will love this dish.